Hi, you guys. Thanks for being here today. I am just going to film sort of a mini makeover quarantine glow up video. Um, oh, a few of us are in need of a little TLC. <laughs> She's a little shaggy and I go in and get my hair cut tomorrow morning and my youngest daughter who is five goes to get her hair cut two days from now and she's really excited because number one it's baby's first haircut she's never had her hair cut and number two she's getting it cut to her shoulder we are getting a little bit glammed up after being quarantined for seven months i am actually gonna do a face mask this evening and just kind of get myself feeling a little bit better about things We've started to make the transition into fall cooler weather so I want to feel good in my skin and my hair and my clothes and um, I'm gonna take you along with me. I'm actually gonna use the detoxifying clay mask from Jordan Essentials. This is our um, bentonite clay mask and we also have a charcoal mask. So the bentonite clay is good for pulling out pollutants and then filling with the good stuff so it leaves your skin really soft and supple. So my face is clean and I'm just going to put the mask on and let it dry for about 10 minutes or until I can't move my face anymore. <laughs> I want to be real generous with the amount that I use. It's just a clay color but when I put it on my face it looks like a mud mask. Okay, one other thing that I'm gonna put on is our lip exfoliant. This is just a lip sugar scrub. And it, I thought about it because I got a little bit of this on my lips. So I'll just put this on my top and bottom lip and continue to exfoliate while my mask dries too. Okay, it's been about 15 minutes and you can see it's really dry. I can really feel it pulling. I'm gonna rinse it and then I'm gonna wash with the gentle cleanser and then do some serums um, for the evening. So with a fresh face, I'm just gonna use first my Time Rewind Eye Cream. And then if I have any left over, I usually just hit the tops of my hands. Tops of your hands are one of the first places to show signs of aging. And then I use my Tone and Firm Serum and I'm gonna use our Essential Serum Booster with the Hyaluronic Acid. And I talked a little bit about the hyaluronic acid in a different video I will link below. I just put a few drops in there. And then, I take that on my hands just real quick. Um, I take the dropper and I just do a few drops on my decolletage here. And rub that in as well. The essential serum booster can be used alone or it can be used with a serum to boost the properties inside of that. I'm going to use our toner mist to set it. And let that dry. And since I just did the face mask, let everything dry. That's what I would normally just do. And then I would just do um, the Moisturizer would be my makeup since it's evening. I'm gonna use our Red Wine Deep Daily Moisturizer with Reservatrol. 
and it's just a cream for the evening. This I can use this during the day. I usually use it in the winter months because it's a little bit more emollient, a little bit thicker for daytime use for me. Um, but I just put that on since I did the mask. It's getting all of that good anti-aging into my skin. Everything I just do nice and light since there's so many layers. Don't feel like it needs to be a lot of anything. And plus, since I'm going to sleep, I don't want it to feel too heavy. That's that. I'm feeling fresh faced and ready for the day tomorrow. I'm excited to get my hair done. A little bit shaggy and just wilted at the ends. So I'm excited to freshen it up. So I just got to the hair salon and sent a text message to my hairstylist. We wait in the car until they come to the door to get us. So she should be out any minute. Here goes. get your hair cut. Good morning. I'm here with my little sidekick. She has been needing a haircut for at least two weeks, but when I called the groomer two weeks prior, she said she didn't have availability, so she's long overdue. So I can't wait to see her this afternoon. I'm gonna drop her off this morning. Made it back from dropping the pup off at her grooming appointment. So I'm also going to share some clips with you from my youngest daughter's hair appointment. It was very exciting. She was actually able to donate her ponytails because she cut so much off. I don't have um, any very good befores from that day. So I'll just insert a couple of pictures and videos from before.
afternoon ready to head in and get Molly real quick I gotta put it back on her. She's so cute. Well, thanks for watching our transformations. We are so happy that we all have our hair cut, aren't we? Are we loving it still? Yep. Yeah. Yes. Molly is so cute. So, thanks for watching. Be sure to give us a thumbs up on your way out, and we will see you next time. Bye. 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 <laughs>